is a relatively new product that's vital for a safe and comfortable home. This is what's called a metal flexible chimney liner. Chimney liners are used for masonry chimneys to protect against the acidic flue gases from our furnaces and water heaters. That acidic flue gases is enough to eat away the mortar in between the bricks and if you don't have a liner you could have chimney failure. While driving through your neighborhood, you may notice a few of these poking up out of the chimney tops. You can usually identify these as neighbors who have recently installed a new higher efficiency furnace. Here's why these are so necessary. Now the problems that we run into with our chimneys is just the way the new furnaces operate. When you get a cold chimney in the winter time and then your furnace starts venting into it and your water heater, it begins to warm the chimney up. Well, just like taking a pop bottle out of the fridge in the summertime, it begins to condensate. You have that condensation that develops on the inside of the chimney. And because of the acidic flue gases, it begins to eat away at the mortar in between the bricks. There we have a problem. This steel chimney liner actually goes all the way down the inside of the chimney, and at the bottom, it connects to your furnace or your water heater. You got a steel cap that comes out off of the top of this to protect any, uh, any birds or anything from getting into it. And that basically creates a chimney within your chimney to help protect and prevent erosion of your existing masonry chimney. These have been around for about 20-25 uh, years but actually been required by code for the last 15 to 20 years so it's something that's very important for your home. The only homes that are exempt from needing chimney liners are those that already have a steel type of chimney. We call that B-Vent. Or if you have one of the higher efficiency furnaces or water heaters that vent out the side and you're not using the chimney whatsoever. A chimney liner installed costs anywhere from $600 to $900 depending on the size of your home. But it can save you money and keep you a lot healthier. For Fox 2 How To, working to keep your home healthy and safe, I'm Jeff Lee.